Let's look at how you can add a solicitor into Locked On. First of all, go to Engine. You'll need to be logged in as one of the admin users and you'll find the solicitors database and hit Add. This will allow you to fill in the details of the person you're dealing with inside the firm as the first person inside that firm and then the company name, their address, add the email and add the phone number. Here you can see I've added in the name, the company, the address, the work email and the work phone and you'll then be able to hit add solicitor. This will now add the solicitor by hitting the view all option. You'll be able to search them by typing in the company name. Here we can see that Austin is the first representative in that firm that we have used. If we are now dealing with someone else at Harmon Law, you would go into the engine, into the solicitors, and you will search Harmon. You'll then find the firm, open it up, and you'll add a new person that you're dealing with by adding in their name, their email, and their phone number. There is no need to add the address as that's stored against the company information. Here you can see I have the name, inside the email I've added the work, and inside the phone number we've added the work direct line. Once we've finished we can hit add. Now that you've added two people under this firm, when you go to a property you'll have two options to select from Harmon Law. On the property lifecycle sales advice section, scrolling to the bottom you'll be able to select your solicitor. If I type in there Harmon, you'll see that Harmon Family Law comes up and I now select the representative that we're using for this sale. I can select Natalie for the vendor and the bottom we can select Austin. Once you've selected them, you can hit the update option and it will save their information as the people you are using as the vendor solicitor and purchaser solicitor in this sale.